Foreign Minister Bilawal Bhattai Zardari is visiting Japan for a four-day trip. A statement issued by the Foreign Office said he was warmly received by officials and the Pakistani community in Tokyo. Foreign Office said the visit marks the revival of leadership-level contacts with Japan after a long break. Bilawal will hold talks with his Japanese counterpart and the Prime Minister, as well as meet with senior officials and business representatives. He will also deliver a talk at the Asian Development Bank Institute. According to the Foreign Office, the trip comes after positive bilateral consultations between the foreign secretaries of both countries. Pakistan and Japan have a long-standing relationship, and previous visits have focused on cooperation in various sectors. France is experiencing a fourth night of rioting following the shooting of Nal M, a teenager, by a police officer. The teenager's funeral took place in the western Paris suburb where he died, with heightened security measures in place. The government has deployed 45,000 police officers to handle the crisis, which is considered the most significant challenge to President Emmanuel Macron since the Yellow Vest protests in 2018. The shooting has reignited long-standing complaints about police violence and racism, particularly in poor and racially diverse urban communities. The unrest has spread throughout the country, with buildings and vehicles being torched, stores looted, and police officers injured. The situation has led to calls for extra troops and the potential declaration of a state of emergency. Authorities are taking steps to limit the spread of sensitive footage on social media and are urging calm. The crisis has disrupted events and raised concerns among tourists. The police officer responsible for the shooting is in custody and is being investigated for voluntary homicide. Mariam Khan, the first Muslim elected to the Connecticut House of Representatives and a Democrat, was attacked in Hartford, Connecticut, after attending Eid al-Azhar -Ah prayers with her family. The incident occurred outside the Excel Center, where congregational prayers were held. The suspect, identified as Andre Desmond, made suggestive comments to Khan and attempted to prevent her from leaving. He assaulted her before trying to flee, but a bystander chased and apprehended him until the police arrived. Khan sustained minor injuries, and Desmond has been charged with unlawful restraint, assault, breach of peace, and interfering with the police. The motive behind the attack is currently under investigation.